Hey everyone, it's Keisha Charmaine and I'm back and I'm here to show you how I went from this brassy reddish brown color to this vibrant bright fiery red. You like to see how I did it? Stay tuned. So the star of the show is Creative Image Adore Crimson number 68. That's the semi-permanent color that I used. I also used an applicator brush, rubber gloves, color wipes are optional, I didn't end up using them, conditioner, and a mixing bowl. I got this one from the Chinese restaurant, you know, reuse it. Oh, and I can't forget Vaseline and ponytail holders. So basically, you just want to mix the conditioner with the color. I don't really have ratio, nothing like that. I just mix it until I have enough for my whole head. Then with the ponytail holders, I separate my hair into four sections. That just makes it easier to apply all the dye, all the rinse, semi permanent color, whatever you want to call it. And first I start with my hairline and then I go down the length of my hair. I cannot forget, you want to be careful, you want to make sure that you're in a place where you won't damage anything. Maybe you want to put some paper down, like newspaper, plastic bags, something, so you don't damage the floors. Trust me, I know from experience. And depending on the dye that you choose, you may end up staining your skin, so use the Vaseline around the perimeter of your hairline and your ears. name that movie we can be best friends <laughs> after I put the dye all over my head I put them in two buns and I secure it in a plastic bag this will help the color really penetrate my locks and really set I use a sock to tie around my edges to make sure that there's no dye dripping and to help keep the plastic bag in place Ugh, I got stain all over me but I've experienced with this dye I know it's not gonna stain my skin permanently it'll wash off right in the shower here's how it looks while wet I apply some coconut oil so if you see any chunks that's what it is I didn't massage it in thoroughly and several days later Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Leave me a comment, let me know how you feel. Like, subscribe, share. Thanks for watching. Love, light, and locks.